Hello everyone. In this video, I will explain diamond problem in C++. So, diamond problem. What this problem is actually? Uh, we are having multiple inheritance in C++. It means a class can inherit from more than one class. So, this scenario actually create a situation in which one class will inherit same property from different paths. So here we are going to create that scenario. So first of all, let me include header file. Now let's create a simple file class A, and this class uh, let's make it a simple function void show, and this function simply print. A class show function. Now, what we are going to do is we are going to create a child class of class A. And we will make it a public inheritance so that class A property is the public member of class B. So, when we use this public inheritance, uh, whatever uh, attributes we are having here, they will be inherited here and they will be having their same access specifier. So this B class is ex uh, inheriting class A show function. And then we are creating one more class, class C and this class also inheriting class A. So show function also available in B class or it is also available in C class. Now we will going to use multiple inheritance and what we going to do? We will going to inherit class A and class sorry class B and class C. So if you can see here, this class D it will inherit properties from B and C. B also having show function, C also having show function. So this class D will be having show function which is actually coming from A. So one copy will be coming from A to B, B to D and one copy will be coming from A to C, C to D. So here when we going to call this function using object of class D. So let's create a object of class D and then call show function. So here how this actually let me show you so here uh, so what is the scenario is that let's say this is the class A this class A is having two child class B and C and these two child class actually inherited in one more class D so here this D is inheriting attribute of A. So one copy will be inherited from this way, one copy will be inherited from this path. So this D is finally having two copy for same attribute. And in our program we are going to call show function. So now what will happen? There are two options for show function. First let the compilation. So, okay, first of all, uh, we miss the semicolon. Okay, now it's done. Again, we will compile. So, here, if you can see this error, request for member show is ambiguous. It means a uh, compiler also confused which show function to call, one which is coming from class B or which is coming from class C. So, this is known as diamond problem in C. Solution for this problem is that uh, while inheriting class A in B and C we can make this class A as a virtual virtual base class. So what is the meaning of virtual base class? Virtual base class meaning if any class will inherit these two classes only one copy of class A attribute or properties will be inherited in that class. So now if we will compile our program, now there is no error. 
so it's uh, simply making a call to class a function so how wha what this virtual keyword is doing this will ensure that properties of a will be inherited to class d only from one path either from b b to d or from c to d but not from both of them thank you very much for watching